Accordance for iOS. This podcast is at the basic level. It requires no knowledge of Accordance Bible software or Hebrew or Greek. Accordance for iOS allows people to travel with their entire Bible study library wherever they go. This free app has become enormously popular since its release earlier this year. It is currently available for the iPad, iPhone, and iPod Touch, and it includes a complete package of free resources, enough to begin your personal study of the Bible today. This podcast, Lighting the Lamp, is sponsored by Accordance Bible Software. It offers free instruction in Bible study methods, reviews of the best resources for biblical studies, and training in our own Accordance Bible software, including both our Mac and our iOS versions. This podcast, number 56, is one of three in a series introducing new users to Accordance for iOS, also sometimes called Accordance Mobile. Podcast 55 covers registration, syncing to your Mac computer, and downloading new modules. And the upcoming Podcast 57 will cover Accordance's mobile, fast, sophisticated searching for words, phrases, and verses. In this podcast, we'll cover installing the Accordance app, navigating, and customizing tool and text views. Installing. Just got your iPad, iPhone, or iPod Touch? Ready to download some great apps? Your first step to great Bible study is located in Apple's App Store. Just tap the App Store icon, then type Accordance in the search field. The Accordance mobile app works on any device. Tap Install, and Accordance will download just like any other app. When it's finished installing, you're ready to go. The initial download includes two Bible translations, the English Standard Version, iOS Edition, and the World English Bible. Five study tools are also included, the ESV Notes and Cross References, which are actually two separate modules, a Greek and a Hebrew Dictionary, Easton's Bible Dictionary, and Outlines of Bible Books. We'd like to publicly express our appreciation to Crossway Bibles for their complimentary copy of the ESV translation, along with its margin notes and cross-references. Register your software and you get even more. Once we register, that's podcast number 55, we can access additional free resources. These include six more Bibles. The KJV, tagged with Strong's numbers and its Apocrypha. The ASV, a French Bible, an Italian Bible, a German Bible, and a Spanish Bible. In addition to that, we also have access to some additional Bible study resources, like Strong's Greek Dictionary, Strong's Hebrew Dictionary, Matthew Henry Commentary, the condensed version, Nave's Topical Bible, the Daily Bible Readings, and the Bible Names Dictionary. Our initial download also includes five sample modules, just so users can get a feel for the power of this app. These include the Timeline, Maps, and Photo Guide 3 samplers, all of which permit pinch to zoom. We also receive three chapters each of the grammatically tagged BHSW4 Hebrew Bible and the Nestle Allen 27 Greek New Testament. If that's not enough, users can always purchase more. Currently, we offer more than 200 different Bibles and texts. These include every major English translation, many versions tagged with Strong's key numbers, and dozens of foreign language versions. For those of you who are scholars, we also have what you need, whatever your subfield of biblical studies. Original Hebrew, Greek, and Latin texts and manuscripts, ancient Near Eastern inscriptions, Dead Sea Scrolls, pseudepigraphic and apocryphal works, rabbinic and patristic material. Likewise, we currently offer over 500 study tools, which cover the entire range between popular and technical. They include 15 different study Bibles, 14 Bible atlases, and over 40 Bible dictionaries and handbooks. We also have many devotionals and Christian classics. Ready for something a little more meaty? How about over 80 different commentaries or multi-volume commentary series? Need images for that sermon or presentation? We have more than 10,000 available in various collections. We haven't forgotten scholars here either. We offer the best of Hebrew and Greek lexicons, grammars, and syntax resources. 
a wide range of textual apparatuses, and collections of scholarly and professional journals. Why am I mentioning all of this here? Because Accordance is Bible software you can't outgrow. And all of these resources are available on your iPad, iPhone, or iPod Touch. And should you decide to buy Accordance for your Mac, they'll work on it too. Navigating. Accordance works in both portrait and landscape orientation. When we launch it for the first time, it will open to Genesis 1 in the ESV Bible. Want to read more? Just swipe to scroll the passage. Either up or down. Want to go directly to a different passage? We use this Go To icon in the lower navigation bar. Simply tap it. Bibles and texts typically use this wheel with book, chapter, and verse. Tools are organized differently. Accordance is smart enough to adapt its choices to each individual module. In this case, we'll select the correct passage with the wheel, and then we'll tap Go To, and Accordance will open to the new passage. Want to see this passage in a different version? Accordance lets us switch translations on the fly. Tap the text name to open a list of similar texts, select the text we want, and Accordance opens it to the very same passage. This makes it very easy to move between different Bibles. Want to see instant details on any word? Just tap and hold the word, and Accordance will open this instant details box. In this case, the ESV translation has been tagged with Strong's numbers, which gives us the translation, the Strong's number, the original Hebrew word, and its transliteration. Dismiss the pop-up to go back to the text. We can add a parallel pane in either portrait or landscape orientation. Just tap the plus on the bottom navigation bar. Accordance then offers us a choice among three different categories, a parallel text, a reference tool, or a user note. Let's choose the reference tool. Then we choose the resource we want, and this time I'll pick outlines. Parallel panes also display in landscape mode and users can adjust the relative size of the panes in either orientation by simply sliding the divider bar. Switching parallels follows the same three-step procedure. We'll move through it a bit faster this time. This particular feature is nice if we own several different study Bibles or several different commentaries and want to check all of them on a particular passage in a rapid manner. Just imagine being able to listen to a Bible teacher and supplement his or her comments with readings from your own library, wherever you are. Customizing Accordance for iOS offers users the opportunity to customize our displays in a variety of ways. We do so in the library using the Settings button. We simply tap the library icon and then the Settings gear. Once in the Settings window, tap the Display Settings. Here is where we choose how we want our texts and tools to appear, though we'll need to scroll in order to see the settings for tools. When we're done with our changes, we simply tap Save. And note that these changes will only apply to new views of both tools and texts. What kinds of changes can we make? We can customize our text views in a variety of ways. We can show paragraphs or verses, either with or without intervening spaces. We also have a choice among several different font faces, sizes, and colors. We can choose several different background colors. We can choose reference color, search hit color, and the amount of letting we'd like between the lines of our text. We can also choose whether or not to suppress poetry and whether or not to hide red letters. Likewise, the following aspects of tool views are customizable. Font face, size and color, background color, hyperlink color, search hit color, and letting. Now, let's see Accordance for iOS in action. Accordance opens the very first time to Genesis 1. We'll swipe the text up, then down, and then add a parallel pane. I think I'll choose a text, like the Demo Hebrew Bible so that we can see how the two texts scroll together. If we tap and hold a single word in any tag text, we can see the instant details, whether it's Strong's numbers in English or full parsing information for each word in Hebrew. 
To customize our display, we tap the library, and within the library, Settings. Now I favor brown text on parchment for my texts, and navy on sky for my tools, each with a bit of leading to make reading easier. Since your settings will probably be different, I'll go ahead and speed up the rest of this part of the recording. Let's see how our new settings look. I'll select the ESV again, but this time add a reference tool in the parallel pane. Let's say, well, how about the ESV notes? We'll then use the Go To feature to select Psalm 23. I adjust each of the wheels, and then simply tap Go To, and both panes jump to that reference. Now, watch how easy it is to switch Bibles on the fly. I pick the World English Bible, and now I'll switch the ESV notes to Bible Outlines. I've paused here to load some of my own reference works. I want to show you how quickly it is to move from something like the ESV Study Bible, then tap the parallel pane again and switch to the Life Application Study Bible and then to Zondervan's Illustrated Bible Background Commentary for the Old Testament just that fast. Now let's take a quick look at a different tool, Accordance's Photo Guide 3, the full version. I'll use the Go To feature again, and notice that this tool is organized alphabetically. I'll select Beersheba. Here I can read the article, scroll through it until I find a picture, look at the picture, move back to the text, then scroll down and see a picture of, let's say, the gate at Beersheba, and zoom in on it. Accordance for iOS is the mobile version of our much-lauded desktop version, Accordance for Mac. Long the scholar's choice, it has recently surged in popularity with a sharp rise of Mac sales. If you haven't used it yet, why not download a free trial copy today? Our next podcast will take a look at searching on Accordance for iOS. If you haven't already done a search, get ready for a big surprise. Its speed, accuracy, and sophistication are unequaled by any other Bible app in the world. This has been Dr. J for Accordance Bible Software. Thank you for watching this episode of Lighting the Lamp. Mm -hmm.